the many years to come? If so, would you please respond with a hearty, we will. We will. And do you also promise to thoroughly enjoy yourselves today and celebrate with a glass of bubbly? <laughs> And will you speak to a laugh with friends and strangers, get up on the dance floor at least once, and go home with memories of a fabulous day? And if so, please respond with another hearty, we will. Yeah. Fantastic. Thank you all. I think you going to have a wonderful time. From the moment they met, Kel and Gary really liked each other and hit it off straight away. The conversation was free-flowing and they discovered they had a lot in common with each other, but they were also very different in many ways as well. They have never been short of conversation since and always have plenty to talk about. Kel and Gary share many of the qualities that they cherish and admire in each other. They are both passionate about their, their children and the importance of their family unit. And they have the same strong values around creating the best possible environment in which to allow Emma and Sarah, Issy and Max to flourish. But they've also brought individual qualities into the relationship, which has enriched both their lives. Kel has brought a real energy into Gary's life. Where he is so laid back, Kel is always on the go. She's more challenging of people and situations, which has inspired Gary to not always accept the status quo. And she's introduced Gary to her passion for wine and visiting wineries, which he's taken on board with enthusiasm. <laughs> Gary has brought a level of unconditional love and support into Kel's life that she hadn't experienced in the past. She knows that she can talk to him about anything and can always rely on him for advice, whether it's business or personal. He also brings calmness and patience into their relationship, as well as a great sense of fun, always cracking jokes and clowning around. And he's a good cook who has brought seafood into Kel's life. <laughs> And they both love having that special someone who is their best friend, someone who loves and respects them, someone who they can share their problems with in a safe and loving place, who they can rely on for support and encouragement, who they can have fun with and explore all that life has to offer. They have such a full life and have enjoyed many experiences together and as a family. In their nearly four years together, they have traveled to almost every state in Australia, as well as an overseas trip to Thailand. They did the Oxfam 100 km walk a couple of years ago, which was a fabulous experience and a huge achievement for them both. And they're looking forward to more travel within Australia and overseas in the future. In their marriage today, Kel and Gary are making the ultimate commitment. Trusting, honest, intimate and evolving. Marriage means creating a future together, sharing a lifetime of experiences and growing old together whilst watching their children grow into happy, confident and independent adults. Kel and Gary, you have stood the test of time together. You have shared the ups and downs of everyday life, the good, the bad, the hilarious and the downright ugly. You have shared your similarities and celebrated your differences. You have supported one another through your troubles and created a great partnership. Today, you are celebrating your past, totally enjoying your present and eagerly looking forward to your future. And on behalf of us all here, I wish you both a wonderful wedding day and even more wonderful tomorrows. Enjoy. Now well, shortly, Kel and Gary will make the promises that will unite them as husband and wife, but first we must hear some important words from the Marriage Act. I, Amanda Mattler, am duly authorised by law to solemnise marriages according to law. Gary Stuart Smith and Kelly Ann Feldstad, before you are joined in marriage, in my presence and in the presence of these witnesses, I am to remind you of the solemn and binding nature of the relationship into which you are now about to enter. Marriage according to law in Australia is the union of a man and a woman to the exclusion of all others voluntarily entered into for life. And so mindful of this, I now ask, Gary, will you take Kel as your wedded wife to live together in a covenant of faith, hope and love? Will you listen to her deepest thoughts, be tender-hearted, kind and wise in your daily care of her and stand faithfully at her side in sickness and in health, choosing her above all others 
will you undertake to care for her well-being of mind, body and spirit as long as you both shall live? Okay. Will you take Gary as your wedded husband to live together in the covenant of faith, hope and love? Will you listen to his deepest thoughts, be tender-hearted, kind and wise in your daily care of him, and stand faithfully at his side in sickness and in health? Choosing him above all others, will you undertake to care for his well-being of mind, body and spirit as long as you both shall live? Okay, and Kel, it's time for you to make your vows to each other. So please join each other. Sorry, face each other and join your hands and eyes. everyone here to witness I ask everyone here to witness that I Gary take you Kelly that I Gary take you Kelly to be my lawfully wedded wife to be my lawfully wedded wife my lover and my friend my lover and my friend the one I will live with the one I will live with laugh with and dream with laugh with and dream with I promise to love you I promise to love you Cherish and respect you. Cherish and respect you. Throughout our lives together. Throughout our lives together. Good afternoon. I ask everyone here to witness. I ask everyone here to witness that I, Kelly, take you Gary. That I, Kelly, take you Gary. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. My lover and my friend. My lover and my friend. The one I will live with. The one I will live with. Laugh with and laugh, dream with. Laugh and dream with. I promise to love you. I promise to love you. Cherish and respect you. Cherish and respect you. Throughout our lives together. Throughout our lives together. Now Max, you have the wings please. The roundness of these rings symbolises eternal love. Its gold speaks of the purity of love. Its value reminds us to look after that which we hold most important in our lives. Kel and Gary, I ask you to wear your rings with love, respect and honour. And now Gary, please play. 